Okay, on to number six. Um, this is uh, a fairly long one, right? So we might need two pages for this. So first one, we we'll go through Ada. Now obviously, important letter comes up a lot. Okay, um, so with Ada, we're going to start at the top left, as we do with all, or mostly all the letters. We're going to come down this way, okay? And then we're going to loop going that way. So it's one loop formed, okay? So we're going around this way. We're going to go up and then do another loop. This one's slightly lower sometimes. And then we're going to come up again. And then from here, we just come down. Okay? And then you're ready to start the next letter, so it's error. But again, just to show that people will do it a bit more flow, they'll go like this. Okay? Ada. Important thing is we're going this way. Yeah? So it's looping like this, down. Now, um, so the next letter after Ada, okay, is Papa. Okay? Now, Papa, uh, we're going to do a slightly different shape from this. We're going to go like that, out, but from here we're not going to go inwards. We're going to go this way, okay, up, and then down. And then you're ready for the next letter from there. Papa. Okay, so again, like that. Now, the next letter is very similar to this um, papa. This is kaka, like kaka for Khalsa. What we're going to do is go like that, go around like this, exactly the same as papa, okay? But then after we've done this shape, we're going to go from here, that way, and then put a line in between. Now, some people will do this, okay, for the papa and the kaka. They'll stop here, okay, then they'll go straight down, and then they'll go like that, okay? That's fine as well. Um, the next letter is kagga, kagga like for kar, for a house. What we're going to do is we're going to go like that, go here, we're going to go up, but then, from here, okay, we're not going to close the line down. We're going to come back on ourselves a little bit and go down again. When we finished here, then we can come down. So again, like here, out, like Papa, up. And then, it depends on whether you want to loop or not. You can, if you want to avoid the loop, do it this way. But now, you have an option. I've gone up and then down, but you can from here, stop there, and draw a line straight down. Okay? And that becomes gaga, like kar. And then for the next letter, we then start from the top there. So it's gaga, kar. Now, uh, the second part of uh, six is um, this series, which is the same kind of shape, but now, you see how, you see how all of these are open okay, at the top. The next ones aren't open at the top, but a similar kind of shape. So that's tata, tada, and then the baba we talked about earlier can come in under this crew as well. So for the next one is going to be tada, tada like for pai taram singh ji or um, tol taram. Yeah. So this is the word tada. Now um, the letter on pronunciation. There's a video on pronunciation. You should watch definitely about how to pronounce this letter and all the letters that are in the fourth row of the Gurmukhi alphabet. If you look at the, the Gurmukhi alphabet up on the screen, you see the fourth row is pronounced by basically taking uh, row one um, and row three uh, to make row four. Actually, that makes sense. One okay, plus three equals four. So you do, for this row, it would be tata plus um, dada, tada. Okay? Um, and has a second sound attached to it. So it's not tada, but it's tada, and that when you get the four, and then you get the third row, and you add that sound with the other on top. If you don't understand that, you can watch that video called uh, four, Five Special Letters of Gurmukhi. But onto tada, then we do a line across the top, and then I pretend I, I like to do this line straight down, so close it off, 
so you get a system like close off and then from here you go down okay and close that off now um, some people will do this okay they'll go down like that just like they're going to drive papa but here instead of starting straight down they will go from here and they'll close it off i i just prefer it this way that they're all closed off as a system so you know you just go like that go like that down very similar shape that comes up in most all the letters but then from here you just do this now the next letter is uh, very very similar to this it's tata tata and that's like um th sound yeah like um thermos th yeah and what we do is we do this exactly the same as tada okay straight down curve around and then just do the line in between so from left to right again you can do it in that particular way which is like to do this okay then like that and then again, this this line comes last. Okay, um, tata. Yeah. Okay, another letter that goes into the number six. Okay, is yaya yaya for yoda. Okay, and all we're going to do here is very similar to what you saw previously, which was uh, uh, kaka and papa and tada and tada. Okay. So remember, we said tada is like this. Yeah, like that. So with this one, we yaya, okay, that's tada, okay. Now we yaya, we're gonna go like that, then down, similar sort of thing, go like this. But here we're gonna go up a little bit and then go across. Okay? Now you can write it like this, so I'll show you the curve, like that, around and up, and then some people will do this after. That's fine as well. But Crucial thing is, you get this curve and then you go up a little bit and then across. Okay, that's ya ya. Very similar to the Y. Similar thing, so Baba, this is like if you're going to say Batak, like a duck, or a Baba, yeah, like Guru Baba Ji. You're going to do line like that across the top. Now, here, another rule that comes up a lot in Gurumukhi is, and this is just a rule that works well for me and it might work well for you, is we try to close the letter off first. So we do the left bit and then we fill in the bits inside. So here, with Baba, you do this and then from here, we're going to go inwards and then out again, close it off. Okay, so um, again, line across the top, close it off down the side, okay, and then from here, it can be a bit more curved, Baba. Right. Um, and it kind of fits in with this section here as well, so I've put it in there as well. But it's just a style of writing that letter, Baba.